And so, how did you get started in chess? Um, my dad taught me how to play when I was little, when I was four years old. And well, I kept on learning, and I got my teacher because they kept playing. So. Okay. So, who was your first teacher? Mm. Um, Oscar Rodriguez. Oh, okay. Okay. So, you've been playing for five years now then, right? You started at four, and now you're nine, right? So, what do you like about chess? What's, what's, what's the best thing about chess? It makes you smart. Like combat, you, you you gotta think too. It just pushes you, pushes your intellect, right? <laughs> okay, that's a good, that's a good. What's your favorite? Um, do you remember like your favorite game or the? Is there any notable games? Any well, any results? Well, was in the nationals when I beat a kid, but. I liked the game very much. Okay. How old was this kid? Nine too. He was also nine. He was high rated than me. Okay. Hopefully not for long, right? Because <laughs> you're climbing pretty soon. Um, last week we saw you <laughs> beating an expert. <laughs> um, what's the? Do you get nervous at the end of games or yes. during the games? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit nerve-wracking, right? Um, who's your favorite chess player these days? Or any group, or your top three or two? Mine is Carson. Carson, right. Mm -hmm. Are there, what do you like that he's accomplished so in such a short time? So much in such a short time, right? Yes. Uh, so you said your dad plays chess, right? Yes. And, um, do you have any tips for him or any other adults who are trying to improve? Yeah. <laughs> what, what advice would you give to... Um. I would tell him to be more aggressive and to um, not lose tempos and try not to um, let the other guy get too much space. Oh, okay. And what about um, like kids? Let's say someone is a kid, he sees this and he'd like to start playing chess. What advice would you give them? Just I would give him like a recommendation to start sports, to it, because when you're in a game and it's very long, you might get tired. But if you do sports, you might um, get, you might be ready for it in a long time, and you might be strong to continue. I would also advise him to um, play against the computer because the computer doesn't make a mistake. So you gotta try to never make a mistake, and you're gonna get better. Oh wow, it's a pretty <laughs> insightful answer for <laughs> you have a very mature approach for um, for a nine year old. Um, so apart from chess, like what's your tell us a bit let's try to find out a bit about yourself. Um, what's like your favorite movie recently? Um Any movies you like? for Bobby Fish. Oh okay. Yeah, I like that show also. Um, do you watch like cartoons and that stuff? Mm. Not really. No. Um, what's your favorite place to say hang out, like in Florida? That's down here. My favorite place. Like, um, like on weekends or. Oh, I go to the beach. I okay. Also spend time with my friends. Okay, just hanging out and <laughs> um, <laughs> playing. Um, do you do any other sports apart from? Um, yes, I do swimming. I do baseball. And um, I do basketball. Oh wow, that's. And do you like play for your school in any? Of these? Um, no. Okay. All right. So, those are some very insightful answers. Um, what, like, when you grow up, what would you like to be? Um, a scientist. Okay. So you like science? And yeah. Okay, that goes hand in hand. All right, Dari. Well. Um, any parting words, like any advice you'd have to <laughs> give to just chess players or kids in general? Just always attack. <laughs> always attack. <laughs> that's a I think we could. That's a good place to end. So <laughs> that that's so. Thanks, Dario, and we'll, I know we'll hear a lot about you in the future. <laughs>